Here in Berea at St. Joe's Hospital, they just received yet another grant. We spoke to Director of Operations here at the hospital, Scott Thompson, about the large check they are awarded from the Robert Wood Johnson Foundation and Catholic Health Initiatives that will seek to bridge the gap for the community here in Berea. This is Pepsi Zero Sugar. Zero sugar, zero calories, but max Pepsi taste. It's okay to get emotional. We know just how you feel. We got a check awarded yesterday, officially. Uh, the grant was from the Robert Wood Johnson Foundation and CHI, Catholic Health Initiatives, which is their parent company, that was routed through our foundation. And uh, it was a check for a little over $1.1 million. That actually gets split between this area in Berea and London, uh, three primary care practices, one of them being here, which is in our building. The money will be used, I guess the best way I can put it is bridging gaps between uh, us and the people that we serve. What we're specifically focusing on are people who are not able to identify resources or don't have the resources that they need to be healthy. We can do things like treat medical conditions, but we have people all the time who are malnourished because they can't afford groceries or they have breathing problems because they don't have good air conditioning in their homes. And this is not all about us handing those people those resources, but there's monies available, people available to help, and lots of times those patients don't know those things are available. And, and so we're actually, in, in London, in Berea, we're actually hiring three, I believe three community health workers to help people identify those resources, bridge those gaps. We're smack in the middle of so many underserved areas. This grant was, uh, it, was in, it was actually a $5 million grant that was in several states. So we weren't the only area but I think that, that we certainly do serve some patients in underserved areas. So I think that, that's why it was a good fit for us. We've had grants that the Robert Wood Johnson Foundation has been a part of, and then we've had some grants that were specific to the St. Joe Berea Foundation, an air mammography suite, cardiology services, some different things over the course of the last few years. Thompson says there will be new hires as a result of this money awarded. For WBON-TV here in Berea, I'm Marissa Hempel.